Curtain. Wait a minute. There's a little sign here. No dogs allowed. And underneath is a cute puppy who isn't a member of unorganized crime. Normally, I ignore any sort of warning sign. But hey, that puppy is really cute. Wait a minute. There's a little no and underneath normally. But hey. Wait a minute. No and normally. But hey. Torture radio room. Well, looky oh. here. If that isn't a radio station, what have we here? Slides of some sort. Probably the plans of unorganized crime. Let's see what those clowns are up to. Wait a minute. Nothing but scribbles. Somebody smeared finger paint on this. But that's... Hello? Wink, please come in. Uh-oh. There's a radio message coming in. Wink, answer me. Wait a minute. I know that voice. I bet it's Cowboy Dodo from the local radio station. Wink, are you going to pick up or not? This is Cletus. I mean, it must be Cletus. Of course, Bull's fiancé. Well, ex-fiancé, actually. He appears to have survived the crash of the escape pod. But what has he got to do with unorganized crime? I'd better answer this. I'm great at imitating voices. He'll never catch on. Hello, Cletus. Wink. Is that you? Why are you talking so funny? I'm not talking funny. I sound exactly like Wink. A phonetically trained ear would hear that right away. Stop blabbering nonsense and get to the point. You know good and well that time is running out. Tell me, have you been able to track down my fiancé? Ex-fiancé, you mean? I mean goal, my fiancé. Wait, I've got the picture you wanted. You can print it as a slide. And here's a picture of the cartridge that holds the ascension codes. Ascension codes, ah, uh -huh. that nincompoop is tough. He's not giving up. Excuse me? My income group's not enough for living it up. Well, that should be the least of your worries right now. Do you need any more materials? Yeah, where are you anyways? Why do you need those ascension codes again? And what's the hurry? I'm sorry. To refuse this assignment. What's the hurry? But I already told you. Yes, but your pronunciation leaves a lot to be desired. Ugh. I'll explain it to you just one more time. Oh, the last high boat will be leaving Deponia from Port of Fisco in a week. So if I don't have the Ascension Codes by tomorrow, I won't be able to get back to Elysium in time. Now that would be a disaster. You said it. Actually, I shouldn't be telling you any of this, but I'm doing so anyway, because I know about the importance of motivating underlings. For reasons that are really none of your business, I must tell the Council of Elders in Elysium that Deponia is uninhabited. An awful lot depends on that. Everything else is insignificant. <laughs> right. Ulysses, the Organon's prime controller, takes no risks. If my report doesn't reach Elysium in time, he will see to it that Deponia is indeed uninhabited. Say what? I mean, uh, <coughs> what did you say? The Organon has the means to turn the entire area around the Rust Red Sea into a desert. If I haven't got my hands on the Ascension Codes by tomorrow, they will drop a bomb from this blast tower. You'll find the coordinates on the next slide. As a result, all life on Deponia would probably be extinguished. This slide provides the proof. But then you would be dead too. Oh, bravo. You're beginning to see why it's so important to me to get gold back. I hope you'll be sufficiently motivated now to find her. Cletus, out. Uh, j just, just a moment. I... Oh, blast it. What do I do now? If Cletus doesn't get the ascension codes by tomorrow, then all life on Deponia will be eradicated. But if he does get them, all of Deponia will be destroyed. I have to beat him to it somehow. Looks like it all depends on how fast I can bring Goal around. In other words, on my charm. <laughs> it can't be so hard then. <laughs> Radio station and button. Hello, Cletus. Rats, he isn't answering. Button. Kitty. Kitty. Oh, how cute. Um. You 
want some drugs? Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, kitty. Yummy din din. Strange, it's not even blinking. Uh, you want some water? Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Yummy din. Strange, it's not even blinking. Not even blinking, which probably means it's bait. Oh, bait. Here, kitty. Yummy. Strange, it's not even blinking. No. Wait a minute. There's a no dogs up. And underneath is a cute puppy who normally I ignore any sort. But hey. Hello? Well, I'm pressing the button. Radio station. Oh, okay. Yep, that's all part. If Cletus doesn't get the ascension codes by tomorrow, then all life on Deponia. But if he does get them, all I have to beat him to it somehow. Mm. Dark alley. I can't do anything there until I get the stuff. Excuse me? Mm. You again? I would really love to join you. Don't be ridiculous. What could you possibly have to offer? Oh, the cat. I certainly am reckless enough. And no, you're not. I certainly... And no, you're not. What was that you wanted me to do to prove oh, I'm reckless enough? Cat. Shave Donna's... Cat? No, no, no. I told you not to shave Donna's cat. That'd be extremely dangerous and stupid. Ha <laughs> ha! Danger is my middle name. And stupid is my, uh, um, hmm. Don't try to stop me. I'll soon be- uh, I'll get back. Whatever. Well, here's the fire. You should always keep an open flame in your overcoat. Handheld vacuum cleaner. I need to shave the cat. How do I shave the cat? Hi. Ah, are you finally going to order? A drink, please. Have you got any money? Well, uh, can I? <laughs> I mean, just look. Uh, why does everybody always come back when you transients don't get a tab here? A drink for the lady, please. Are you trying to get me drunk? Would that help? I can drink you under the table on an empty stomach, you scrawny thing. So you might as well not even try. Not even try? <laughs> Do you have any idea who you're talking to? A fellow who can't afford a drink? Uh, yeah. Bummer. What else is there to see in the floating black market? Don't tell me you're a tourist. In that case, you'd better go uptown, assuming they let you in. Downtown is reserved for smugglers, fences, gamblers, and pirates. For a special thrill, I recommend watching the platypus pataka in the market arena. However, fighting only takes place when two squabblers are going after each other. Can't the jukebox play a different song for a change? What do you mean? It plays a different song all the time. Are you sure? It does sound pretty familiar, you know. Leave my jukebox alone. Nothing but classics in the playlist. My favorite is the mating song of the junk crab, but only when the doors close. I have enough complaints about crab bites as it is. Gulliver's Gully. 
Doesn't sound terribly inviting. My customers aren't used to being invited anywhere. Who would want to invite thieves and smugglers? Or people with infectious mouth diseases? Now, if you're looking for an inviting ambience, you'd better go uptown, kid. Uh, I've got a few questions regarding your regulars. Spit them out. Don't you ever run into problems with the Organon? To me, it looks like everyone here is doing whatever they want. That's right. The authorities leave us alone here. Porta Fisco is far away, and the magnetic train route runs along the coast. That's how the floating black market was formed in the first place. We're always in places where the Organon doesn't look. And if I told you that it won't stay that way for long? Then I would tell you to go join Janosch and his resistance windbags. Only an idiot would believe in that conspiracy crap. Do you know I Captain can Bozo? Do that. Sure. He drops anchor here on a regular basis. I think he's got something going on with the owner of the weapon store in Little Venice. She won't break your heart. She'll perforate it with a repeating laser. And Bozo has a thing going with that fury? I can hardly imagine how that would work out. <laughs> That's because you have no idea how to deal with temperamental women. You really should take a page out of his book. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I get it, because he's got pictures, right? What kind of people usually hang out here? Well, riffraff and rabble, you know, thieves, cutthroats, but the good kind. Well, it's pretty empty at the moment. Always is this time of day. Besides your people, only Nod is here now. He's with unorganized crime. I think he's here now because his brother Wink took over the first third of the preliminary five o'clock shift today. But as you can imagine, Unorganized crime schedules are a little obscure. And then there's Garland. He comes here to play. So what does he play? Rock, paper, scissors. Seriously? Your dangerous rabble plays rock, paper, scissors? Mm, it may not sound like a game for tough men, but the stakes are high. And they play with loaded fingers. What can you tell me about unorganized crime? I wouldn't mess with them if I were you. They're dangerous and unpredictable. If you want to know more, go ahead and ask Nod over there. You mentioned an underground movement. What's up with that? Well, calling it an underground movement might be somewhat exaggerated. Garlef and his friends, Janos and Lebo, hold regular meetings in Janos's mother's basement. <laughs> That's got to be a joke. It is. And the punchline is Janos, their leader. He thinks he's some sort of freedom fighter. Hmm. Go on, tell me about Bozo's girlfriend again. I think he's got something going on with the owner of the weapon store in Little Venice. She won't break your heart. She'll pump. And Bozo has. I can hardly imagine. Ha! <laughs> you really. Oh, yeah, because he's. That's it for now. Yep. See you later. Come back. No, never, never. Hmm. Brains or fish? Hey, hold still. Oh, darn it. Oh. It seems to have some sort of motion sensor. Motion sensor. I'll catch this fish with my bare hands. I'll catch this fish. I'll catch this. And then I throw some water on it. I'll catch this fish. Where did my golden dragon? I must have lost it. You want, you want some bait? Catch this fish with me. Hey, hold still! Oh. oh, is that supposed to be a razor fish? To me, it looks more like a sword. Is that supposed to be a razor fish? To me.
this what I'm supposed to use to shave the cat with? You want some drugs? I'll pack this book. I'll pack this. Hey, hold still. No. Oh. oh, it seems. Mm. Here, go to. going to do yeah burn baby burn <laughs> yeah burn <laughs> Never caution is required. The colorful ones like to bite back. Oh man, that was a lousy Easter. <sighs> I knew that was gonna happen, but I still don't know how to grab these. I uh, never touch stuff with them. I just don't have any clue as to how I'm supposed to pick up these eggs. I uh, never touch. Wait a minute. Do this. I think I just got it. I think I just got it after 10 hours of playing. Is that supposed to be a razor fish? To me, it looks more like a sword. Oh! Oh! Look what I caught, dude! Look at this! A fine specimen, wouldn't you say? What the? Don't tell me you caught that! <laughs> sure looks like it. Holy head. Perhaps I misjudged you. Just how is that possible when you have so little fisherman's luck? What's your secret, buddy? They <laughs> call it fisherman's luck. I use a special kind of bait. Huh. And now he claims to have a... Wait a minute. Bait is important. And you must have caught that razor fish somehow. Could it be that you really got a special bait? Are you calling me a liar? Not if you show me your bait. Huh. What's in it for me? Well, I could offer you a tiger fish. An ordinary tiger fish against my fantastic special bait? You must be a few worms short of a can. Forget it then. Forget it then like so totally. Ha! See if I care. If you want a tiger fish at some point, bring your special bait. If not, shoot. I got special bait in my pants. What's that supposed to be? What do you think, my special bait? Of course. Hmm. That really does look like genuine bait. All right. Maybe you do know how to fish. You can take a tiger fish. A tiger fish? Stand still. <laughs> Are you serious? You can't even catch a fish that's already on land? I didn't want it. It was suffering from epilepsy. Yeah, whatever. Keep your bait until you really want a fish. Otherwise, beat it. Can't place a cup anywhere. This guy over here is winged.
<laughs> shaving the house cat of a criminal syndicate would be really extreme. So oh, extreme shame. that they would be guaranteed to make me an honorary member. Well then, let's do it. Let's do it. Huh? What's this? This is stuff. Then where's the real kitty? Ah oh, well, who cares? See, boss, boss. Here comes the boss. How's my hair? <laughs> what a question. Perfect as always. What? Who? What's all this about? I mean, where's the boss? Somewhere behind this mad woman? <laughs> I caught an intruder. Oops. Ah, uh, poor kitty. Good kitty. Kitty, 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 kitty. This little dipshit shaved kitty. What do you want us to do with it? My thoughts exactly. Feed him to the sharks. But she's only twitching. Th this lady suffers from ticks. <laughs> well done. Now you've really ticked her off. So, any last words? Mm. I want to make Donna an offer. I want to make Donna an offer. <laughs> All right. Donna, listen. To get you the cartridges with the ascension codes, I give you my money. I can join you! <laughs> Donna said no. I have another offer to make. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, what did she say? Isn't that obvious? That I'm being pardoned? <laughs> what? I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> Got me there. What are your plans for me anyway? <laughs> <laughs> right. Hmm. I have another off. <laughs> All right. I can get you the cartridges with the ascension codes. <laughs> Donna said no. Really? I have another off. <laughs> <laughs> I have another. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. I'll give you money, a lot of money. <laughs> Donna said no. Mercy! <laughs> <laughs> right. Mercy! <laughs> what? I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> Got me there. What are your plans? <laughs> <laughs> Will you please tell me now what that winking means? <laughs> yes. That I'll be made into shark food? <laughs> Bravo! You guessed it! Yippee! What do I win? Oh. I really want to know what you're planning to do with me! <laughs> Donna said no. Go ahead. A quick and painful death is better than having to endure this farce any longer. <laughs> <laughs> right. We're agreed then. Hey, no, wait! It's not too late to be friends! Say bye-bye, Rufus. Uh-oh. That wasn't pretty. Do you really want to skip to the mini game? What the? Do you see what I see, Donna? <laughs> Looks like once wasn't enough for him. 
<laughs> what do you want us to do with it? <laughs> Again? <laughs> right. My thoughts exactly. I don't even know what they want me to do. <laughs> they don't even explain anything. Will you please tell me that? <laughs> yes. That I'll be made in the. <laughs> Bravo. Yippee! Oh. Mercy. What are your plans? <laughs> <laughs> Will you please? <laughs> that I'm being pardoned? <laughs> what? I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> Got me there. I have another offer to make. <laughs> <laughs> right. I have another offer. <laughs> All right. I could join you. <laughs> Donna says no. I have another. <laughs> <laughs> I have another. <laughs> All right. I could join. <laughs> Donna's. What are your plans? <laughs> <laughs> Will you please? <laughs> that I'm being. <laughs> what? I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> Got me there. <laughs> I have another. <laughs> All right, Don, listen. I could get you the cartridges with the ascension codes. <laughs> Donna says no. Mercy. <laughs> <laughs> I have another. <laughs> All right. I could get you the <laughs> Donna. What are your plans? <laughs> <laughs> Mercy. <laughs> what? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> I have enough. <laughs> <laughs> I have enough. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Donna, listen. I refuse to negotiate with criminals. Have it your way. I really want to know what you're planning to do. <laughs> Donna's. I have another offer. <laughs> <laughs> Mercy! What? I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> I have another. <laughs> <laughs> I have another. <laughs> All right. Forget it. I refuse to negotiate with criminals. Have it your way. <laughs> Mercy! <laughs> Donna's. What are your plans? <laughs> <laughs> Mercy! <laughs> what? Are you... <laughs> what are your plans for? <laughs> <laughs> I have enough. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Forget it. I refuse to negotiate with criminals. Have it your way. Go 
ahead. A quick and pay. <laughs> Donna says no. What? I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> now you have me confused. Are you being serious or not? <laughs> Huh, she nodded. Did you see that? Yeah, but I can hardly believe it. Apparently, that means that you are now one of us. Congratulations, uh... Rufus. Rufus, right. There's not many that make it. Two so far. How did that happen? Yay. Yo ho, yo ho, unorganized criminals, yo ho. When do I get my old stocking mask? Yo ho, unorganized. Hey Donna, any jobs for me? <laughs> well, I'm afraid it'll have to wait. I have my own mission. There we go. Finally, my own tournament hand. Okay. May I bother you again? And you're going <laughs> to. I want to play. Yeah, yeah, but when they're not loaded. So, how exactly does this work? The rules are quite complex, I must admit. But you really only need to remember three things. Scissors beats paper. Paper beats rock. And rock beats scissors. We only play with real tournament fingers. Any attempt to play with loaded fingers automatically counts as a lost round. Ha, <laughs> got it. What's the stake, anyway? The winner gets to pick two fingers from the loser's hand. What? We play for fingers. What else? First person who has no fingers left to surrender after a lost round loses the game. I'm ready. Well, then, lift your hand. One, two, three. What is this? Paper beats rock, rock beats scissors, scissors beats, uh, whatever. Scissors beats paper. Sounds simple enough. Sucks that Rufus can't control the other hand. He has little choice. The shown symbol only depends on the number of fingers. An intact hand only shows paper with two fingers missing. It only shows scissors and a hand with no fingers left is always considered stone. Wait. Only depends on the number. An intact hand only shows paper, which makes sense. With two fingers missing, it only shows scissors and a hand with no fingers left is always considered stone. Only when Rufus lost all fingers and then wins them back can he can show any symbol he wants. No, oh, that should be enough. Wait, what is this? Those are loaded. Any attempt to cheat counts as a lost round, so you need to surrender two fingers. What? So what did you think this was about? Get on with it. Put your hand on the table. You didn't stand a chance. I told you so. Want to play a game? So that's automatically scissors? No, oh, that should be enough. Wait, what is this? Those are loaded. Any attempt to you need to What the You win. Even though these are my lucky fingers. Oh it ain't over as long as I have some fingers left. There. That one again. You ready for this? So he lost two fingers. Which means he's going to be choosing scissors. Wow. 
What's that? Rock, you're trying to be clever now. Just you wait. So now he has no fingers. So he has rock. What? He had no fingers ah, left. You need to... He had no fingers left. that rock you're trying to be just you what's that rock you're trying to be clever just you okay what's that rock you're trying to be clever now just you wait Darn it, you're a fast learner. Looks like I'll have to open a new bag of tricks to win. Darn it, you're so like impossible. You you beat me! <laughs> Don't mess with Rufus! That's what I keep saying. Oh yeah! <laughs> Looks like I underestimated you. Well, be that as it may, I'm an honest player. And I keep my word. This is our secret knot. Can you remember that? Yeah, I'm not so sure. Can I hear it again? Uh, but you mustn't tell anybody else. <laughs> Nobody but gold. What was that? I need some alcohol now. <laughs> ah, me too. Baby gold. Oh, oh, I must have drifted off again. Did I miss anything? Not really. That's nice. Tell her that I joined the rebellion. I have joined the rebellion. Hmm? Oh, it's you. How nice. It is done. We are resistance fighters. Really? Sure. I even know the secret knot. Wow. Then what are we waiting for? We have to go to Janosch and get our instructions. Last one there is a rotten egg. But no, no. Hey, hey, stop. Oh, rats. Okay, now I gotta... Du, du, da. Du, du, da, du, 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 da. No, wait. That isn't the secret knot. Uh, I know. I just got it a little mixed up. The knot goes... Du, du, da, du, 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 da. Wrong again. Beat it. Crap. It's just because of that snappy groove they play in the marketplace. Du, du, da, du, 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 da. No, wait. That isn't the secret. Crap. I just can't get the marketplace. Are you serious, dude? May I bother you again? And you're gonna do that. <laughs> Got it. What was that secret knock again? Uh, I keep forgetting that myself. I think it's because of the music they play in the marketplace. It tends to make my head spin. Now, this is the knock. Got it now? Yeah, I think so. What was that secret? Uh, I, I think it's it tends to make my head Now, this is. Got it now? Yeah. I'll be off there around. Du, du, da.
to, to sad. To no, wait. That isn't the secret knot. Crap. I just can't get the marketplace rhythm out of my head. <laughs> that must be the rebel base Garlic was talking about. No, wait. That isn't the secret knot. Crap. I just can't get the marketplace rhythm out of my head. I'm doing the secret knot they told me it was. Hi. Ah, the new guy. What's up? Well, guess who's your latest member? Great. Finally, someone who can scrub the deck. That's really needed after lying at anchor in White Bay for almost a week. White Bay? Strange name, that. Why? Plenty of seagulls there. Hey, do you... Sure. Unfortunately... I'll get back. Whatever. May I bother you again? Aren't you gonna... <laughs> Got a... What was that secret... Uh, I, I think it's because... ...to make my house. This is the... Got it now. Yeah, I I'll be off there around. Can you write it down for me, man? Let me see. What's that supposed to be? <laughs> you want some drugs? Let me see. What's that supposed to be? <laughs> Let me see. What's that supposed to be? I can't go here without, without going through the market. would be weird but can I turn the music off ah garlic did you get us that new recruit uh sure finally a new face after all these years Janosh is gonna flip out and a woman too nobody's gonna laugh at us now just let me in okay Hmm, that could be right. <laughs> finally. But I'm not sure. I can never remember the new knot. Could you knot the old one again, just to be sure? But that's pure harassment. If you're one of us, then you ought to know it. And this had better not be a knock-knock joke. Hmm, with my superb memory, I actually ought to remember how it goes. He did knock it once before. All right. And this had better not be a knock-knock joke. Don't make me come out there. No, wait. Wrong again. Too better luck next. Ow! I can't. And this is better not be a knock knock joke. No, wait. That isn't the secret knock. Crap. I just can't get the marketplace rhythm out of my head. Du, du, da. No, wait. That isn't the crap. I hmm, that could be right, but I'm not sure. 
could you not build one again, just to be sure? And this is better not be a knock-knock joke. What about it? <laughs> and this is better not be a knock-knock joke. Hey, that's enough. I'm coming out now. I don't see the humor in knock-knock jokes. Huh? There's nobody here, so it wasn't a knock-knock joke after all. That isn't the new knock, Lebo. Yeah, I forgot it again. Can't I just use the old one? Oh, yes, okay, but only because it's you. Now I've got it. They all sound the same to me, man. Hey, that was right. Of course it was. Well then, what are you waiting for? Come on in. The door's Thank open. Thank God, man. The door is what? Finn suggests to turn on the music again. Oh my gosh. Ah, there's a new recruit to eat last. Our course is getting the attention it deserves and a smother of respect. Say what? What are you getting at? Attention. And? A smother of respect. <laughs> Just listen to you kiku. <laughs> stop it. No, wait. Don't stop. How can I stop if you never tell me what it is that defines you achieving the humorous? <laughs> Bravo. Awesome. But <laughs> Seriously, what place is this? Some kind of circus? Because, you know, I'm really looking for the hideout of the resistance, not a carnival. You have come to the right place. True. Carnival was last week. Okay. <laughs> I've had toothbrushes that resisted the organon better. Why didn't you ever use them? And you seriously want to go up against the organon? We still haven't decided who goes up when it's time. We wanted to draw straws, but Lebo started crying. Hey, not in fear. I had a splinter in my hand. Have you planned any action for the future? Friday is karaoke night. Uh, actually, I was thinking about an operation that has something to do with the Organon. For example, an assassination attempt on Bailiff Argus. Just last week, Janusz distributed uh, inflammatory pamphlets. Ugh, lame. But at least it's a start. Yeah. Unfortunately, he only made one copy, and I had to read over Garleth's shoulder. Well, that was pretty cool, figuring out the puzzle of turning off the music. That's supposed to be a plan? <laughs> All I can do is laugh in disdain. They haven't even drawn in a giant eagle to rescue them from an exploding high-rise at the last second! Oh, hello, Rufus! Have you joined the resistance too? That's me, always in the wrong place at the right time. <laughs> Let's go, nothing's happening here anyway. But Janos said I need to stay here and fight for our grand cause. He's the leader after all, right? What do I have to do to make you come along? I'm so sorry, Rufus, but as long as Janos is in charge here, I simply can't leave. How can he be in charge? You can barely understand a word he says. True genius can never really be understood. Oh. But your health is at stake. We need to repair your implants. Janosch says that when you fight for a good cause, you must be prepared to make sacrifices. Really? And what is he sacrificing? He's our leader. I'm sure he would lay down his life for every last one of us. Really? For me, too. Can he please do that right away, then? That would be great. Yes, Yanush is truly great. What do I have to do? I'm so sorry. But How can he be? You can barely treat. Oh. Yanush is an idiot. Yanush says one must be an idiot to go up against the Organon. In that case, he's probably overqualified. 
I would be a much better leader than Janos. But Janos has the master concept. Bah! Janos doesn't even know how to pronounce concept. That's just because of his damaged tongue. He says it's an old injury that never heals properly. Did he eat too many chili dogs? 25 chili dogs in 10 minutes. Wow. See? He's as tough as they come. My concept is better than Janosh's. Really? But Janosh says his concept is the best. So how can yours be better? Just wait and see. This is so exciting. Don't go away. I'll be right back. Don't worry. <laughs> what? No! No, 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 no! No! Oh my gosh, I thought I did the same thing again. Mm, this isn't a good time. I'm about to convince her to come with Okay. Greetings, retreat. What's up? <laughs> The word is greetings with an F. That's what I said. Greetings with an F. <laughs> you call yourselves a resistance cell? You look like a bunch of total losers to me. That may be your first impression, but the truth is, we're a fanchishing bunch. Yanis! Would you new friend like a glass of orange juice? No thanks, Mom. Never be again. Huh. You guys being venturesome? Well, at least we have a concept. So, what's your concept? We're sitting here discussing, snacking on ships, and questioning about the unfairness of being oppressed by the Organon. <laughs> and what exactly are you hoping to move that way? Move? Who said anything about moving? Well, isn't that sort of implied by the term underground movement? Oh, that, yes, well, of course we are moving, as well. <laughs> I wasn't talking about circling the sun and drifting away from the other tectonic plates. Oh. Your concept is crap, for crying out loud. You can't even pronounce the word concept properly. If you have a better concept, then let us know. To come to pick I up have gold. come to pick up gold. Impossible. She must assist me with essential tactics. <laughs> she must what? Assist. Shay, are you shitting on your ears? Goal is in urgent need of surgery. In the resistance, one has to make sacrifices. What if she suffers permanent brain damage? Then she will have suffered brain damage for she good coach. I've got. A concept. Uh, what? A concept. As in plan. Ah, a concept. For a second, I thought you said concept. But if you mean a concept, I'm very interested. Just insert your slidish into the projector. I've got to go. It's people are a Slide projector. Hey! What is that all about? I'm taking matters into my own hands now. You want to stop the Organon? I'm all for it. But you're going to need the right leader. Someone who's got courage and charisma. Shake, shake. With clear elocution. Shake. In short, someone who can go up against the Organon all by himself if need be. Cowboy Dodo from the local radio station is charismatic enough. I was talking about myself, you dodos. Don't make me laugh. What could possibly qualify you for that kind of responsibility? What do you think? I've got a concept. Yes, oh yes, a slideshow. I bet this is going to be so exciting. Watch and learn. Oh, what is that? A spot? Impossible to recognize anything. Schlong? Okay, now this is uh, uh, just a, a spot. 
But for starters, just a spot in that is your concept? No, no, it's, it's just, it's the wrong slide. If you handle your troops the same way as your presentations, then forget it. Yanish is right. We're just wasting our time with this show-off. Oh, too bad. I was so looking forward to the concept. Wait a minute. That was only a test. It's not a spot. Of course. What is it then? This long. A symbol. A shimble? How mysterious. The concept sounds pretty exciting already. Positively mystic, with just a hint of legend. Shut up, Lebo. And what does it symbolize? It shows what will become of us if we don't act right away. Wow, this is shocking. You're a pretty glib talker. But do you have any proof for your claim? I most certainly do. Here. What's that? Organon Blast Tower, Organon Bombing Four, Organon Bombardment Bay, Organon Shelling Place. This is an Organon Blast Tower. The Dark Exchequer has distributed these towers around the planet. I find that disturbing. Are you scared? I don't quite understand. Why would the Organon build towers like that? What's the purpose of those places? To smash the globe, destroy the world, eradicate Deponia. Our enemy will try to eradicate Deponia. What? But are you really sure? Of course. It's true! The order comes from the Elysian Council of Elders. They have no idea that Deponia is inhabited. Inconceivable. But what are we going to do about it? We've got to attack them. Our troops need to strike first. Our team will dare to attack. The resistance has to start an offensive. The resistance has to start an offensive. Attack the Organon. Are you out of your mind? We don't even know where to strike. Yes, we do. I am in possession of secret knowledge of the exact position of one of these towers. Got a hand on the coordinates of one of the Oregon on bases. I obtained topographical data locating one particular Oregon on four. I know the location of one of these blast towers. I like this one. I obtained topographical data locating one particular Organon fort. Wow. He seems to be really well prepared. I thought there were hundreds of blast towers. Why should we talk to this particular one? Our enemy might... Drop a bomb here and thus kill off everything that lives by the water. Detonate a bomb here and put an end to all life marine... And on land, blow up a bomb here and thus destroy the environment in and around the ocean. Explode a bomb here and thus make the area around Rust Red Sea inhabitable. Explode a bomb here and thus make the area around the Rust Red Sea uninhabitable. That's horrible. Rufus is right. We must prevent it at all costs. But what comes next? What about all the other blast towers? Ascension codes might be the one... The Ascension Codes might be the one Joker we haven't played yet. The stored data in Gold's cartridge might serve as an ace up our sleeve. Gold and her brain in impant might impant? Feel like they misspelled that. Might mean an important trump in our hand. The secret knowledge in Gold's mind might represent a valuable advantage. The secret knowledge in Gold's mind might represent a valuable advantage. So far, I understand it all. Can you give us a brief summary? I will do that. Uh, no, no, you don't have to do that, Janosch. I, I, I can do it myself. No, no, I will summarize this. Uh-oh. Pat, what are the heavens? <laughs> don't laugh, Rufus. Exactly. W what was that exactly? An Organon Blast Tower. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> oh, my belly hurts. <laughs> <laughs> He's done it again. What a jerk. Oh, just when it was getting really exciting. I am disgusted. Get lost, you scoundrel. <laughs> oh, man. I blew it. <laughs> There's no need to. I want to prepare for whatever it is that. Yep, that's all. What is Shat supposed to be? What does it look like? Like some random object you found in the trash? It's part of my concept. Well, I hope it isn't a very important part. Um. So why did I fail that again? Hey! I thought we would go kill I mean, I, and I'm sure you have to fall speed. Get your ass off! I, I, I'm completely touche show. What is this? A symbol. A shimbo? How mysterious. This Our enemy will try to smash the globe. Yeah, okay, but what are we gonna do to prevent it? Our troops do we know? And where would that be? I am in- I remember. Keep talking. Our enemy m Explode. But what shall we do if- The Ascension Code. So far, I understand it all. Can you give us a brief summary? I will do that. I, I, I can do it myself. No, no. I will show. Uh oh. Well, show the first slide again, will you? Exactly. W what was that exactly? In Ogenong Blished Tower. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my belly hurts. <laughs> <laughs> He's done it again. What a jerk. Oh, just when. I am. So Get this no is, <laughs> oh so man, this is failing blue. because he's laughing? Organon, okay. An Organon bombardment base or bombing fort. An Organon shelling post. An Organon shelling post. Uh huh, go on. To smash the globe. Our enemy, yeah, oh. Maybe they don't want me to select ones that have S in them? Our true doing it. I know I remember 
our enemy. Detonator, but what shall we do about mm. so far? Can I do that? I don't, you don't have I, I, I can no, no, I do show. Uh oh, okay. Show the first slide again, will you? Exactly. W what was that exactly? An organ on show post. <laughs> <laughs> He's done it again. What a jerk. Oh, just when I am. Uh, get lost. <laughs> oh, man. I blew it. <laughs> An organ on shelling post. Oh, this is just. Don't you ever give trial up. Trial and error. One last time, alright? The symbol. Okay, I'm gonna choose things that don't have S. An organ. See, none of these have S's in them. Our enemy. We've I am Definitely Goal, can you give us a brief summary? I will do that. I uh, don't no, you don't have I, I, I can do no no. I, uh oh. Okay. Show the first slide again, will you? Exactly. What was that exactly? An Organon bombing fort. Our enemy will try to destroy the world. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's done it again. Oh, just I, uh, get low. <laughs> oh man, I blew it. Okay, so yeah, don't choose S. Select it, please. Don't you ever Norganon bombing fort? An organ. Our enemy will try to eradicate the podium. Our enemy. We've got to attack them. No. No. This one. I am pink. Drop a bomb here. Detonate a bomb here and put an end to life marine on Detonate land. Detonate the store goal and her brain implant of an important trump in our hand. Can you give us a? <laughs> <laughs> He's done it again. Well, I messed up because I couldn't see where I messed up from. Symbol, bombing for, our enemy will try to smash, our enemy will try to destroy the world, no, our enemy will try to eradicate the our enemy. we've got to attack them, if it's not this one then it's gotta be this one. Um, I've got a hand on the coordinates. I obtain tropographical. I Drop a bomb here. Detonate a bomb here and put an end to life, to all life, marine and on land. Blow up a bomb here and thus. Explode a bomb here and thus. Detonate a. Goal and her. So far, can I will do. I, no, no, I, 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 no, no, I will show. Uh oh, okay. Show the first slide again, will you? 
Exactly. What was that exactly? An Organon bombing fort. Our enemy will try to eradicate Deponia. Our team will dare to attack. So far, so good. And what is this? You obtain topographical data locating one particular Organon fort. Our enemy might detonate a bomb here and put an end to all life, marine and on land. Almost done. Gold and her brain implants might mean an important trump in our hand. Bravo. That's all very well, but how does it help us? Okay. An Elysian inspector named Cletus is currently here on Deponia. Goal accompanied him. That's why she's here in the first place. Her codes serve to activate the last high boat in Fort of Fisco that is supposed to take her back to Elysium. We have to let Elysium know that Deponia is actually inhabited. Therefore, I will take Goal to Elysium. But of course, you could try to sway the Council of Elders. Once they learn that Deponia is inhabited, they'll cancel the blast. But why should you of all people go to Elysium? Because I'm the spitting image of the inspector. <laughs> That's highly unlikely. But it's true. Rufus and Cletus could be twins. What a strange coincidence. And it gets even better. Argus's cruiser has docked at the blast tower I indicated. Its mission is to take Cletus and Goal to the high boat in Porta Fisco. During the attack, Goal and I can make use of the ensuing chaos to overwhelm Cletus. And then I will take his place. What do you say? Are you with me? That sounds very risky, but it's our only chance. Any more questions?